Great job for West Florida Tech as they advance. More playoff drama on the way. Baker trying to stay undefeated and push back into the state semifinals. Plus, we go to Alabama. W.S. Neal out to keep their amazing late season run going. And Escambia Academy getting another crack at Otaga Academy and a state title. All that coming up. For Escambia Academy, it's pretty safe to call Otaga Academy their nemesis. The Cougars losing to the Generals three times in the last two seasons, including in last year's state title game. EA getting yet another chance for redemption. The Alabama Independent State Championship matchup in Troy. Same location last year when Otaga pulled it out by seven. Four weeks ago, top-ranked Otaga beat then second-ranked Cougars 42-20. to Early first quarter, Otaga puts it on the ground. Fumble, Jamie Welker recovers for the Cougars. In the first meeting earlier this year, it was turnovers by Escambia Academy that was a killer, and they cash it in immediately. Patrick McGee ripping off this one, getting it down to the one-yard line, and that would set up the quarterback, the junior, Jacob Daw, going to sneak it in there, and they missed the extra point, but it was 6-0, and the fans from Canoe enjoying it. Now back on offense, Daw going for Nikel Robinson in stride. Beautiful 50 yards on that one. Somebody came to play in this one, 12 nothing. This can be in the lead. Otago trying to throw now. Look out. Wow. The huge hit by MJ Jones. Fumbled Jason Davis, the sophomore. What a play for him. All of a sudden it was 18 nothing. This can be Academy. They are giving it to the nemesis. 18 7 at the half. Third quarter now more. Air attack. Daw to Freddie Flavors. Fred Flavors doing his thing. What a year he's had. 24 7. Cougars in the lead. Hugh Fountain can feel it. And they would keep on coming. More terrific defense. The interception here by Trey Turner. He brings it back into General's territory. And that would lead to himself. Turner going over the top of the touchdown. They were blowing him out. It was 30 7. But Otago would get within 10. EA facing a third and 16. Turner just wants it. He just wants it. Gets 19 yards in the first down. That would seal the deal. And they've got a shiny trophy coming back to Canoe as Escambia Academy wins it 30 to 20 is the final second state title in program history. The other one back in 2014. Turner and McGee both went over 100 yards rushing. Daw threw a couple of touchdowns. Happy times for Escambia Academy. I couldn't have been proud of the boys. I mean, you know, the bounce back. This season and bounce back from losing last year says a lot about the character of the boys, and I'm very proud of what they did. We did what we supposed to do, and did what we uh, said we was going to do, come in here, and don't give them nothing, you know, play hard as we did last game, and keep it going all the way to the fourth quarter till the end. I mean, we like brothers, and um, the first game, we first, we ain't played like brothers, and we've been working so hard, I was summer long for this, and we've been waiting on this moment since the beginning of the summer. We got it. It feels great, man. Word can describe it. I've been waiting, you know, four years for this. And for it to happen, man, to go out like that with a bang like that, it's, it's, it's a great feeling.